my office asked Cliff. He, he can tell you look at the bottom of the uh, the page. It has the year or something, months and year. The, the revision number something. Yeah. yeah. Term versus UL. Okay, so I talked about a lot this one last time. Uh, let, let's go go through one more time. Forty years person, forty years old, by a thirty year term. Right? By the time the person is 70 years old, the term expires. The policy doesn't expire, right? Everybody knows that? Remember? The term policy will not expire until what? 95? 95 years birthday. Yeah, 95th birthday. So what expire is the term. Term is what? The price will not change during this period, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The price once after thirty years, the price go up a lot. <coughs> Nobody can afford that. Yeah. So it will be too expensive to convert or, or buy a UL, convert to UL, or buy a UL, or buy another term. Seventy years old, you can buy a ten-year term. Yeah, too, very expensive, and the client may not be able to qualify. Mm -hmm. Right. At this old age, the client will have critical or chronic illness soon. When you get old, right? When you you are still young, people they have heart attack, cancer, stroke, but percentage-wise, it's less. When you are 70 and older, more and more people they have heart attack, cancer, stroke. That's the time the ABRs is going to help them because when they are old. They have those problems. They do not want to put a burden on the kids. So, to, to be honest, if you think think about a lot of or majority of people, after the retirement, their mortgage loan is not paid off, right? We all know that the people they are 40, 50, 60, or early 60 years old. They still buy house, and so the mortgage loan is still there. So they have payment. If, if, if they run into medical problems, then they get tough luck, right? So our ABR policy will help them. So when they are old, the term price guarantee expire. The price start going up. They cannot afford it. They let the policy lapse. Then after the policy become lapse, they run into critical illness or chronic illness. They have a problem. That one. That's why term may not be good for them. Right? What's what how to select a product to recommend? That, that, that's one of them. You need to recommend the universal life more than just term. Term is cheap, so you think it's easier, easier for them. To us, to buy it from you, so you can make a sale. But it's not good. Yeah. So it's.